Good morning guys and welcome to today's video. First of all, please excuse what's going on on my face. I've been like stress picking all my pimples on my face and so just ignore that. <laughs> but it is now Sunday. Yesterday we actually had nothing going on so I just decided not to start the vlog yesterday. It was actually really nice not doing anything around the house. We just stayed in. We didn't even go to Harris's parents' house. We just all hung out and relaxed and it felt really, really good. But today is now Sunday and there are a few things that I wanna get done around the house today. And then I also have a few to-dos on top of that, like on top of the chores that I wanna do today. I need to do laundry. I wanna do our sheets. I wanna do the boys' sheets. Jack did wake up this morning and his bed was a little wet. So I wanna do the boys' sheets. I wanna do our sheets. I need to do their laundry. I need to run to CVS. I got some pictures printed for a little homework that the boys had. So I have to go to CVS today. I wanna to plan their meals. I need to um, place the order for the groceries to come tomorrow. So just a few chores and to-dos that I have on the list for today. Right now, of course, I am out getting some coffee the boys did come with me this morning they've been loving to do that and i told jack last night that he could and the first thing he said when he woke up was get croissant so we of I course had to too. get our diapers changed get some shoes on and head too. out to pick up some croissants so we got little benny back there and we got jackie both of them are enjoying their croissant i got myself one that i'm going to have when i get home and then of course i picked up harris and i's coffee he is at home so i'm going to head back with them and probably have a little bit of a slow start i think the first thing i'm going to do is gather all the laundry so that i can get that going for today but for now i'm going to head home and i will check in with you guys when i start like planning when and the order that i'm going to do all my chores what happened here what are these what are these toes toes where do your shoes go in the, in the mom car in mommy's car, you took them off. You took them off. Mm. You're silly. And mommy needs to clean her car. I think I'm adding that to the to-do. Maybe we'll get around to vacuuming mommy's car today. Uh. And these car seats. Jeez. Okay, the boys are downstairs playing with the nugget with Harris, and I'm upstairs. I'm going to strip their beds. I also need to do their sleepy sacks and i think i'm going to do their kikis as well just because those haven't been washed in a hot minute and they get very dirty because they bring them around the house with them and then i'm going to strip harrisonized bed so i could do all of that in one load and then the second load will be the boys clothes <laughs>
please excuse the lighting it is raining outside so it is so dark i feel like fall is hitting us so fast the weather has been so crappy after it being so sunny and nice for like a month the past few days have either been nice but chilly or rainy and gloomy so of course today's a rainy and gloomy day and so the lighting is off in the video but harris decided to take the boys with him to run some errands he had to go to the bank quickly and then i think they were going to get bagels for lunch so the boys were out with him and i wanted to take the opportunity with them not running around and it being more mellow and calm in the house to show you guys the bento boxes i mentioned these in my last vlog and said how i ordered them for the boys for lunch and they came in on friday so i'm super excited to go ahead and use these these are linked to my amazon storefront and i think they were like $15 each which I think is a pretty fair price some of the bento boxes on Amazon are like 30 plus dollars and to me I don't know if that's worth it I've never had one of these before so I don't know if the more expensive ones are better but these ones were about 15 and I think they're the perfect size they fit perfectly in the boys lunchbox I did go ahead and get them in blue and they just snap close all around and then it has four different compartments and I think these are just like the perfect size to put like their yogurt pouch their sandwich a snack a fruit um two snacks if I even want to do or if I want to put their sandwich here and put their yogurt here I have to figure out how I'm going to assemble their lunches in these but these are perfect it cuts out all extra containers and those silicone ziplocs and all that kind of stuff it's just like a one stop shop for packing their lunch so I got these in on Friday and I'm super excited to use these on Monday I do have to go ahead in a little bit and write out what I want to make the boys for lunch for this week. I want to get in the habit of writing everything out on Sundays so that I can have a nice list and just like know what I'm going into the week with and know what I'm going to be making them for lunch so that they don't get like repeat lunches back to back and I'm not scrambled in the mornings. I do plan on filming a full like morning with us to show you guys how our mornings operate on the days that they have school. But I want to write out their meals so that I A, know what I'm going into the week making and B, can order groceries later on tonight to come tomorrow so that everything that I need I know we're gonna have in the house i have some ideas i've been like looking on pinterest and different like toddler lunches i just want to keep it fun and exciting for them we've definitely fallen into the habit of them having like a pb and j every day in the house but their school is not free so i'm trying to think of different fun lunches i want to do like a makeshift lunchable where you pack like deli ham cheese cubes crackers i could do a bagel one day i could do um sunflower butter like peanut butter but with sunflowers i could do that a sunflower and jelly sandwich i can do like pasta um they're into muffins right now so i figured i could do like two or three muffins with some fruit on the side all that kind of stuff so in a little bit i'm going to sit and write out what i want to do for lunch this week and then later on tonight i'm going to place the order for groceries for them to come tomorrow we are definitely very low in the house so tomorrow's lunch is definitely going to have to be a little makeshifty but after that once i kind of get into a groove of things with like ordering the groceries on sunday and everything like that i'll be able to execute all of this um better this is obviously the first time the boys have gone to school so it's just getting into a new routine but i'm super excited that we have these if you're in the market for a bento box for your children for lunch or even for yourself to pack lunch to go to work i think i'm going to order another one of these for harris um i definitely recommend these ones they seem super sturdy i think they're bpa free they're dishwasher safe trying to think what else i will um link my amazon storefront down below if you guys are in the market and you want to buy one like i said i think these were like 15 bucks which i think is pretty good but um i'm going to i don't think the laundry is ready to be switched over yet so i think i'm just gonna sit on the couch and hang out until Harris gets back with the boys i do have an errand to run later i actually have to go to cvs to pick up some pictures that i got sent to be printed because i or the boys got homework this weekend i have to put three things in a paper bag that they sent home that explain or like show who the boys are and then i also need to send in a family photo so for their little baggies i printed out each of them a picture with like their favorite person right now so for ben i have a picture of him and lala if you guys know ben loves his lala that's my grandma and then for jack i have a picture of him with harris's dad who is pop pop he loves pop pop so those pictures i need to pick up later and then i also need to finish up their little homework activity later on as well but i'm gonna go relax while the house is quiet and get hopefully like 20 minutes of relaxation in what'd you get Rainbow Beagle, is it good? Dad, dad, dad. What? Dad, dad, you went with Daddy, mm -hmm. and you got Rainbow Beagle. Mm -hmm. Benny, what about you? Is it good? Play-Doh and Rainbow dad, Beagle. Dad. Don't accidentally eat your Play-Doh.
Okay, the boys are downstairs having some apples now. It's about 11.30 and the rest of the laundry from the first load is still in the dryer. I was able to take out their sleepy sacks and their blankets and they're fairly dry. I would say like 98% dry. So I went ahead and took them out so that I can put them down for a nap shortly. I'm going to take out their other set of sheets that are in the hall closet here that are already clean and put those on their bed. And then I'll just fold the ones that I wash and put them in the closet when those are done drying. A bunch of the stuff got like trapped in the sheets, so that stuff wasn't dry. But thankfully, their sleepy sacks and their blankets are. So I'm going to go ahead and make their beds, and then they'll go down for a nap shortly. And when they're down for their nap, I'll run my errand. Okay, so we have the before. I'll do a little transition. And we have after. And the boys do have their blankets. Um, ben has his blue one, and Jack has his blue one. I put his black one back, but now their beds are all ready for their nap. Okay, of course I run out to run my errands and it starts pouring rain and I did not plan or dress for the rain so I just got caught in the rain but I am done at CVS. The boys are done for their nap and I'm done at CVS. Like I mentioned, I needed to pick up some pictures for their little like homework lesson for this week. It's like a little bag where you pick three things, whether that be like food, a hobby, a toy, a picture, a person, anything like that that represents who you are and so for the boys i decided to print out a picture of them with their favorite person so for jack i have a picture of him with harris's dad who is pop off and then this is my favorite picture of ben and my grandma we call her lala i call her mo that was her name for me growing up but they call her lala and this is from this past trip down to florida it is ben and lala in the pool so i'm going to put each of these in their brown paper bags i think i'm going to put a soccer ball for ben because he's really been enjoying soccer right now and a toy cookie because a cookie is his favorite favorite food right now I'm still trying to decide what to put in Jack's bag but these will go in there and then the school also needs a family photo for their family tree and I don't know if I need two considering they have the same family they might only need one but I decided to print out one for each of the boys just in case they both needed a photo and this is from this past Thanksgiving yeah this past Thanksgiving I swear Harris and I only ever get good photos on Thanksgiving I think my other favorite family photo of us is from two Thanksgivings ago and then this is my favorite one as of now and this is from last Thanksgiving so almost a whole year ago so hopefully this year we can take another one and kind of update our favorite family photo but this is from this past Thanksgiving so I'm going to put these in their backpacks and hand these in and then I also decided to pick up some mini M&Ms I was able to write down all the lunches that I want for the boys for this week as well as our grocery list and place the order for groceries to be delivered to tomorrow but in that I wanted to make a little toddler trail mix I mentioned how I've been going on Pinterest trying to find like creative lunches for the boys and I came across a toddler trail mix I did have to tweak the recipe just a little bit because their school is not free but it calls for Cheerios raisins or craisins yogurt cover raisins anything like that um, a nut which we're not going to do and then M&Ms but I decided to do the mini ones and so I was able to order everything for that um, from Stop and Shop but they were out of mini M&Ms so I picked up two I don't know how many I'm going to need I think I'm going to start with one batch with one and we'll see. But I, I was thinking when I was writing out their lunches for this week that I kind of want to do kind of like a what we eat a day, but more so like a what they eat in a week and share with you guys their lunches for every day and what like goes into it, the ingredients, all that kind of stuff. Let me know down below if that's something that you guys would want to see because I think it would be interesting and fun for me to film and fun for you to watch to kind of see the different meals that I come up with for them and also give you guys ideas for your toddlers if you need whether that be packing a lunch for school or just feeding them something at home so I plan on making them a little toddler trail mix for something sweet in their lunches but let me know down below if you want to see that kind of video I can definitely film that in the next few weeks but this is it for my errand I'm gonna head home now the second load of laundry the boys clothes is in the dryer and once that's done I just have to fold that stuff and then I'm completely done with all my to do's and everything I have to get done today Do Who's that? Who's that, Jackie? Mama. Wama. Hey. <laughs> what do you got? Um, bed. What? Um, bed is all clean. Your bed's all clean? Uh-huh. Smell good? I hurt your finger. I hurt your finger. I'm sorry, baby. Oh. <laughs> uh. uh. It's all dry? Uh -huh. Good. Uh, I can't reach brother. You can't reach brother? <laughs> you want to get out? <laughs> you want a snacky? Yeah. And then do you want to help mommy fold your laundry? Uh-huh. Uh-huh.
And then we'll do laundry. Ah, you don't want to fold the laundry? You want mama to do it? Uh, oh my god. <laughs> okay, okay. It's too big. It's too big? Yep. Use two hands. Pull. Uh, uh. Oh, thank you, baby. Mommy to do it. Oh, you need mommy to do it? <laughs> you don't want to help? I want to pet. You want to help? Avengers! Avengers! Okay, you're going to help mommy do quick? Tie tie! Blue tie dye. Let me see. No, 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 no. You got to hold, uh, hand it to mommy nicely so I could fold. Uh, oh, well, that was very nice. Can you do uh, gentle? Tie. All right, can you put all the sockies in this diamond right there? Put all the sockies over there so mama could fold them together. Uh, Good job. Thank you. Uh, Open another socky, Ben, here. Put that one with the other ones. A towel. A towel. I got another one. Got another one? Good. Uh, Jammies, okay. Jammies. Jammies. Another towel. Can you put that towel on top of that one right there? Let's make a towel pile. And another one. More sockies. More sockies. All right, hand it to brother. He's in charge of the socks. Hand the sock to brother. And there you go. I got you found them. Hey. Thank you, Sean. Towel. Hand that one to Jack. Jack's in charge of the towels. Can you take the towel from brother? Jack, can you take the towel? Here, can you put the towel with the other one? You're in charge of the towels. Good job. I'm a good one. Is, that, is it empty? Not yet. One more thing. Ah. One more thing. Thank, I'll take that one. Thank you. It's other sake. You found another sake? Can you put all the sake in? I have all the sakis now. Put them away. Oh, Benny, there's a sake over there. And one Can you get that sake for mommy? Thank you. Can I have all the socks now? Where are all the socks? Ready? No, that's just one. Brother has all of them. So I could fold them together? We need a towel with towel. That's dirty. You could put that in there. That's dirty. Thank you, baby. Dirty. You dropped one. Can I have that one that's right behind you? <laughs> no, we don't hang on the dresser. Excuse me. We don't hang on the dresser. I eat the dangerous. Yay! Good job, boys. Thank you. No more. Teamwork. Are you? There you go. Mommy, take it off. Take what, your sleepy sack off? Uh-huh. Okay, and can you get me your shorts that are over there so I can put them on you? Your shorts are over there. Am I missing jammies? Oh, no, because these ones were dirty this morning. What are you doing, silly head? I'm ugly. It's okay, baby. <laughs> I do. Okay, it is a while later. When the boys woke up from their nap, they actually wound up helping me fold the laundry, which was really nice. It usually can go like either one of two ways. Either they're very helpful and we're able to get it done quickly and efficiently, or they become crazy and start throwing the laundry all over. And it almost went that way, but it didn't. They were actually very helpful and we were able to get all of their laundry folded. We got up, had some snacks, played downstairs, played upstairs, watched some TV, had some dinner. And now, as you can hear, they are going crazy in Harris and I's room because I just went ahead and made our bed. And so we have like no duvet cover on the bed, just the sheet. And so they are going crazy jumping on it. They love doing that when we change the sheets. But I was able to finish every single to-do that I had set for myself, except I remembered this morning that I said I wanted to vacuum out my car and I didn't do that. So I'm just going to add that on to next weekend's list. Kind of roll that over and we'll worry about that next weekend. Okay, I have Benny here with me now. He said his belly ache. I think they're being a little too crazy in the bedroom. But like I was saying, I'm going to roll that over to next weekend. I really want to try and get in the habit of doing these like bigger chores on Sundays. Um, planning out the boys' meals, planning out our meals, ordering the groceries, doing the laundry, doing the sheets. Harris went ahead and vacuumed the entire downstairs. So I want to get in the habit Mommy. of doing these things on Sundays so that we can prepare for the week that's ahead of us. It's just kind of getting into a new routine with hi. the boys being in school now. Hi. You're saying hi? Say hi, vlog. Hi. 
Hi, boss. <laughs> Mommy. Hi, baby. Hi, brother. Where is brother? Uh, uh, hiding the, what? Uh, hiding the closet. He's hiding in the closet? Uh-huh. No, he's in Mommy and Daddy's room. It's Mom and Dad's room. <laughs> um, so, yeah, kind of just getting into a new routine, getting a lot of stuff done on Sundays to prepare for the week ahead. So, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Why are you spitting your apple juice out? You're making a mess. <laughs> and with that being said, I'll see you guys in our next video. Bye, guys. I